Okay, guys, here. End game Proto Bahamut Guide. Live on stream. I'm playing Fairy right now. Fairy support with a stun build. And you'll see why I'm playing stun build later. So everybody splits up and everyone takes a cannon. Everybody has to pick a cannon and stick with it. You, this is your cannon. You can actually DPS him during this part. So the first part is he summons balls. Uh, if you're on this side of the ship, you have to destroy these balls. Otherwise, they blow up your team. And you want to just kind of throttle. Like, you don't want to like keep using Gatling because it will overheat your gun. Oh god, one got in. But you, I, I like using this to shoot because it's free. So after that, he's going to use a... He's gonna keep, keep summoning balls first. Then it's coming out. All right, this again. So when he, when he does this Arcadia, you have to kill this thing. And I don't use my Purge Spirits here. It's going to be very tempting to use Purge Spirits here. You don't want to do it. And the reason why... Is because the instant Bahamut comes in like this... You want to stun right away. See how much stun that did? I'm going to come in. I'm going to buff my team. Pop Richten. And then just... DPS hard. Alright, back to my cannon. Because Bahamut is going to again shoot us with the um, light balls. And it actually helps if you let go of the aim for a bit when you're retargeting, because it moves faster when you're not aiming. Well, you're not shooting, rather. The, it moves faster. Oh. He comes in and crashes there? Sorry. Oh, for some reason it missed. There we go. Still got it. And you want to do this because it's really good damage. Light balls again. You got to get on your gun and shoot these. And uh, the, again, this DPS actually works on Bahamut. So when you have this on you and your range, you want to stay away, then just hop out. So you're not like, you're not dropping it on top of the melee. All right, he's gonna crash in again. And again, I'm gonna set up Right away, for stun. Rebuff. And again, with your chains, your chains, you want to wait until the end. So you give your team as much time as they can to DPS. So I'm going to wait till it's like kind of towards the end before I, I hit the ult. You don't want to do it right away. Gives you maximum DPS window. All right, back to the cannons. Skyfall. When Skyfall drops, you just move to the sides of the ship. Really easy. The only thing is, after this first Skyfall, it comes out really fast. So you basically want to... So this is like, take note. Take note that this occurs. That's what it is. So the future Skyfalls will be very fast. Reagan lives, so I'm gonna try to get in and I'm gonna try to get the break here. Once it passes me. Another DPS window buff. 
And Rick did with the luck. And then I'm just gonna DPS again. You want to save, like, your buffs? If you're playing fairy, you want to save Henriktan for this. So you get the most time in with it. Swipes? So after that, like, Bahamut will now start throwing in that swipe. So you can get in here on the cannon, shoot a little bit. So Bahamut is going to be swiping during this as well. So you have to like kind of keep a peripheral vision on on Bahamut, so you're not getting hit by those. And again, I'm gonna stun right away. Oh, I screwed up. I, I should have rebuffed there. I'm gonna try to build up my pets again so I can rebuff. Okay, got it. Got my rebuff up. Okay, we didn't get another. We didn't get a chain burster, but it's okay because some of our some of our players have uplift. So what happens? We're just gonna do it. Like, oh, we didn't get it there, but usually we would just try to drop it right there. So about fifty percent. You got absolute judgment. It goes into overdrive. Supernova. So, Supernova, pretty easy to deal with. You move to your corners. Whatever your gun is, you move the corner, you wait for this. To come in, you go in here, you just keep going, and you just jump a bit, and it will just blow up. And then you move back because of the uh, Skyfall. But this one sucks you in, so you have to keep running. All right. And then the Claw. You can try to get a stun in there, but it's 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 really rough. The timing on that. This this regular you just block. Blocking really good in this game. Just just block. You don't have to you don't have to risk it. Or you can. If you if you feel if you feel spicy, you can risk it for like the heals and the buffs, but and then you have to get these these balls. All four people. There's gonna be four, one, a two on each side. Each cannon person has to do them. Otherwise, these things get a shield and it makes them impossible to kill. I like to get in the middle here and just hit both. Fairy. So it's gonna bust Bahamut. We're gonna crash into him again. And again, same, same thing. Pop that stun as fast as possible. I'm gonna S SB here. I'm gonna SB here and then re rebuff. I'm actually gonna save my Henrik in here. In case we get a link. Basically. Because it has kind of a long, uh, long cooldown on it. Just to keep damaging here. Alright. Back to the cannons. Always back to your side. Swipe. Just basically just block. Block, move out of it. Like, you can really just hold the block. There's, like, no reason to not. So, Bahamut, I think, here is gonna fly back. Yup, and right here, you just wanna get off the cannon. When you see Bahamut fly back, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a Skyfall. So, if you're on the cannon, you see how fast that comes out? That's gonna blast you if you don't get off right away. Bahamut's gonna come in again. Regan Lee, I'm gonna try to get past this and hit my stun. There we go. Bahamut's gonna fall down. I'm gonna rebuff. Uh, I'm gonna pop this. Oh god, I got hit by the bite. He bites there. I was trying to rebuff.
Come on, make it. Okay, now Bahamut's on the other side of the ship. Okay, you gotta get these bo balls again. If you don't get that again, like it's gonna have a really big buff. Watch out for the Bahamut Claws because that gets added in here. I get my son off. Our deep is a little high right now. So we probably won't have the link later. Gonna rebuff. Really, really big DPS window here. So now that you have to get into 20%, you need to save all of your resources. Because the final phase is a DPS trap. Reagan leave. Just block. You can get on the cannon to DPS a little bit here. Again, we're saving our Ogis now, but like it's actually looking like we might not have them. Skyfall. Whenever Bahamut flies really far back like that, it's going to be Skyfall. I have to watch out for the bites. But I want to get the stun off here. I want to rebuff. Okay. If that happens, just block. Remember, just block. When in doubt, just block. Of course you can parry, but like, okay, now overdrive, so Bahamut's gonna fly to this side. We actually, ideally we want to have light detonation here, but me, I'm the light character, I do not have Ogi. So this is probably, we don't have Link up either. So we might actually want to wait for it, actually. I'm not sure. Never mind, we're not waiting. But that should give us all Ogi. Oh, I messed up. Uh-oh. It's okay. I can use my Ogi as a buffer. I might have thrown there. We'll see. Nah, we're good. We got damage. Yeah, I just hit mine now. I tried to get the extra Henrik and damage off. It's fine now. Yeah, we have enough damage. Leaf, I'm seeing a common theme here. Well, actually, I wanted to go third because I had uh, Henriksen up, but I just didn't press it fast enough. I wasn't really that worried. But yeah, that, that's it. You just want to save like all of your resources there for that that last uh, last DPS check. And then uh, you don't get a. Uh, you don't get a you don't get a weapon drop. That's that's uh Did you get one? What'd you get? What'd you guys get? Wait, what weapons did we get? I'm asking what weapons we got. What dropped you guys? No weapon drop. 
Oh, sorry, as I didn't get. Okay. Well, anyway, that's Bahamut, Proto Bahamut. Could have been a little cleaner, but live on stream, no paid actors. <laughs> 